feeling? Yeah, good, mate. Um, obviously, very exciting to be in a, a prelim final. Um, obviously, we you know got pretty lucky on the weekend to get here, but um, you know we're really keen and um, excited to go this weekend. Yeah, uh, a bit of rehab, mate. To be honest, um, obviously missed last week, uh, but um, you know I'm tracking really well, and um, I'll take it day by day. Don't need to really rush anything, and I'll give myself enough time to to get right. Uh, just got to get back in the training, mate. Um, didn't train very um, much at all last week, so uh, I'm trying to sort of leave it to the back end of the week, but um, couldn't get over the line. But, um, you know, this week I've started really well and had a little trot yesterday and um, hopefully can get, um, get in the training tomorrow, so um, that's probably the next box to take off. Yeah, I'm pushing very hard. I'm a competitive guy and love playing, uh, especially around finals. And um, I, was, I, was, I was I was probably giving the, the physios a bit of a headache last week because I told him I was sweet, but he obviously didn't think so. So, uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm keen to get back. And uh, the, probably the, the thing that I don't want to do is go out there underdone. And um, if I don't get through the game, it puts my team under pressure. So um, I'll make sure I'm not. Cast tricky, Jerome. What sort of percentage are you now? And um, like I said, I, I feel pretty good, uh, but I'll leave it up to um, our physios to decide, uh, I guess, what percentage I'm at at the moment. I um, haven't really been talking about that too much with them. I was sort of talking about it last week when I really wanted to play, and uh, I guess the percentages weren't too good on uh, in my favour. So uh, this week it should be a bit better, and you know, I feel I feel really well. And, uh, ran really, really well yesterday. So, but like you said, um, calves are tricky. You don't really want to be, um, like I said, going into a game underdone, and you can hurt it pretty easily if you do that. So, um, I'll, I'll definitely be smart with it. Just watching from the box last week, did you notice things that sort of didn't quite work? Because obviously, no points the week before, and tries to come by last week as well. Did you see things that sort of the way things are working that we you thought you could inject yourself this week? Should you play? Uh, yeah, you see a little bit when you're, I guess, watching. It's it's, it's easy to see while you're you're up there instead of out there. It's a little bit difficult, but um, I thought we made you know big steps compared to the week before. I thought our spine played really well and you know got a bit more opportunity um, than the week before. So that's what we need to do to play well. Is just um, the spine and getting the balls in the hand. It's a pretty daunting taking on Penrith in Sydney as well. I mean, they've beaten you twice this year. What sort of gives you confidence that you can turn things around again? I think if we just play our footy, we'll be all right. Um, you know, we we need to play it for the full 80. They're such a good team, and they play right up to the final whistle. So uh, we need to be able to do that. And um, I think if we can, we, it gives us a good shot. Are you surprised that tries tries have been so hard to come by the last few weeks? And the three, four week body work, you know, put your finger on maybe why it's been so hard to score. Uh, I think of that Bronco game. We just didn't give ourselves a chance. We turned over too many cheap ball and um, you know our discipline wasn't really good and like I said you give that to a, a good team and um, you know they'll they'll damage you but I think you know finals is you know a different level of footy and um, all the good teams you know show up defensively and uh, I've just seen that with you know the Bronx and, and Penner. Is it hard because you missed that last round against the Bronx as well so they played once in sort of a few weeks now coming to the big prelim can you come in and coming off the calf as well. I mean, you're confident that you can step up and really adapt straight away to what's needed in a big game? Yeah, I think so, mate. You know, we've done a lot of training during the year and um, I probably haven't been training with the team, but I've been out there and amongst it. So I know what, what we need to do and uh, what's expected from myself. So uh, I don't think it'd be too much of a change, to be honest. And, um, you know, I hope I get a couple of days of training in this week and uh, we're putting in those reps. How much are you relishing this challenge going into their backyard? I've been the benchmark for years now. Yeah, it's definitely going to be a challenge, mate, but um, I guess that's why you you play footy, you know, to play against the best and try to beat the best. So, um, you know, they've been the best for the last couple of years and um, playing down there in Sydney is going to be tough. Um, you know, obviously it's not their home ground, but uh, they're going to have a lot of their fans out there and um, it's going to be a, you know, a tough, tough challenge for us. But, um, you know, the boys are really keen and they're really excited and, um, you know, 
being in a prelim, you got to be excited, and um, you know we need, need to put our best foot forward. It'd be very tough to be honest. Um, even last week, I was I was a bit of struggling to not watch, but I was just struggling that I wasn't out there, and um, you know, especially in a prelim as well, it'd be really tough. So. Um, hopefully it doesn't come to that, but if, if it does, you know, it's going to be tough, but I've just got to, you know, help out the team where I can, if, even if it's, you know, before the game, getting around the boys and um, helping out where I can.